Agar is a new insecticide from Bayer. It's a new Group 28 product that has a new active ingredient, tetranilaprol, which is new to the Australian market. We're in a crop here where we're targeting codling moth, but in terms of this style of products in this group, it has a really broad spectrum across multiple crops. So in our case, it's uh, palm fruit, stone fruit and almonds, and you know, a spectrum of pests covering the likes of weevils, through to medfly, through to Carpophilus beetle species in almonds and stone fruit. So it's quite a, um, quite a wide fit. And also from an IPM point of view, we have a fantastic fit, uh, really trying to protect those uh, beneficial species, including beneficial mites, which is really important for an area like we're in today. Codling moth has a major impact in apples and pears here. Uh, if left untreated, you can nearly have 100% crop loss. That first generation is, is critical with codling moth and if you've got a, a really strong product up first like Vallejo, it makes the rest of the season a lot easier. Um, and certainly for growers, yeah, if they can get on top of that first generation, the, the rest of the season generally is not too bad. Our experience this year with Vallejo, like it's probably our third year where we've seen it. Um, and this is the first year commercially. And um, it's been really positive, particularly when targeting codling moth. It's probably the best Group 28 at the moment from what I've seen. Viego uh, provides flexibility on two levels. You know, one, it works extremely fast, so application to control is, is really fast, and then we've got a really long residual control. So from a farmer's point of view, you, you're gonna know that if you're, you're spraying with the label interval, then you do have that control. On the other side of the flexibility, affecting all life stages of the codling moth pest means that you know if you've got adults present and you've got eggs present and you've got larvae, then you know you're gonna be affecting all three of those. I guess where Viego adds value is its superior efficacy. It's also very broad spectrum. So in situations where some, say an apple growers has multiple pests like a weevils and codling moth or light brown apple moth, you know you're gonna have a high level of control against all of those pests with that single application of Viego.